create a 3D floating text without 3D element. First, what you're going to do is create a new composition. Any duration will do as well. And give your comp a name and hit OK. Then click on typing tool with T and type down the words you want to write. If you have more than one word, then command D to duplicate the first layer. Then press P to open position and move your text around, adjust it a little bit. Feel free to use snapping, which is a tool that helps to center and align your elements. Then if you haven't already, go into dafont.com and download three-dimensional round text. It's completely free and it gives off a really nice fake 3D effect. If you already have it, select it in your character box to both texts and feel free to change the color. I'm going to be using a nice light blue. Then you're going to go to your first text element, open up text and select animate, then position. Underneath animator 1, you're going to add a wiggly selector and adjust your position at the beginning of your playhead. I'm doing 50. You can also change the speed. I'm doing half a wiggle per second just because it looks more floaty. If you want it to go faster, feel free to put anything greater than one. Next, I'm going to go back to my animator and select rotation. In animator 2, I'm then going to select wiggly again and adjust my rotation. Just a little bit will do and I'll probably do half a wiggle per second because it looks a lot more natural. Just have a look at your text and make sure you like it. When you're happy with the flotation of your text, you can duplicate using Command D of that first text layer and position it. You can delete the previous layer if you had already made it. I'm gonna show you now two ways to stylize your text. The first one will need Sapphire. So we're going to type in Texture Flux select that. Just change the frequency to make it look a little more like water and the color as well. Then go and select glow and we don't want it too bright so I'll put 1.5. Then edge rays. You want to have half the brightness and there you have it. This is another way to do it without any plugins. So we're going to select stylize glow in After Effects presets. Right click and pre-compose that text layer so we can apply light rays. Look for the center icon and just drag it to where your text is. Then we're gonna go into the effect controls and just duplicate light rays effects for each letter. So I'm going to do this four times, just dragging the center to each of the letters and adjusting the brightness because it is a little bit too bright go into effects and presets and search for fractal noise then we're going to select the blue and the white in fractal type we want to select swirly overlay for the blending mode then you can adjust the colors and complexities as you like and head back to your original composition all done if this was helpful please don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye!